Design of Water Tank Let us design a rectangular water tank for a family of five persons. As per IS code, 135 liters are needed for daily use per person per day. The volume of water required in liters per day for five persons equals per capita consumption per day times number of persons equals 135 times 5 equals 675 liters. Now, let us build a water tank having 3 feet depth. The volume of the water tank equals length times breadth times depth equals L times B times 3. Here, the volume of the water tank is equal to the volume of water consumed per day. Let us add 15% extra in the tank volume for the sump and emergency needs. So, the required volume equals water consumption per day plus 15% of daily consumption equals 675 plus 15% times 675 equals 675 plus 101.25 equals 776.25 liters. As you know, 1 cubic feet equals 28.3168 liters. So, the volume of the water tank in cubic feet equals 776. 25 divided by 28.3168 equals 27.41 cubic feet. Now, volume equals L times B times 3. 27.41 equals L times B times 3. By cross multiplication, L times B equals 27.41 divided by 3 equals 9.14 square feet. You can choose any one of the lengths or breadth according to the available space for the tank construction. Suppose the ideal required length L equals 4 feet then. L times B equals 9.14. 4 times B equals 9.14. B equals 9.14 divided by 4 equals 2.285 feet. The dimension of the water tank for holding water per day equals L times B times H equals 4 feet times 2.285 feet times 3 feet equals 27.42 cubic feet. Note, if you want to store the water for the two days requirement, then you have to double any one dimension or recalculate for the two days water consumption. For example, let us take two times the breadth to double the volume of the tank. Equals L times two times B times D. Equals four times two times 2.285 times three. Equals four times 4.57 times three. Equals 54.84 cubic feet. Double the volume of 27.42 cubic feet. Thank you very much for watching. Please do make sure you subscribe to the channel by clicking the red button below the video. That way you aren't missing out on any of the videos I upload. Also, I would very much appreciate it. If you gave the video a thumbs up, thank you very much. I hope you have enjoyed that and it has gotten some way to help you. I sincerely hope you understand how to design a rectangular water tank. Thank you so much, have a great day.